Hey, it's me again, Daniel. In this video, we will take a look at the Stereo Encoder, a plugin you can use to encode mono or stereo signals into Amisonics. Please listen to this video via headphones, as the audio track is binaural. I've inserted the Stereo Encoder in a track with 36 channels, so we can produce fifth order Amisonics. On this track, there's a stereo audio file, and the output is routed to the Amisonics bus where I have a FD, an FDN reverb plugin, which is currently deactivated, and the energy visualizer plugin, which you can see in the lower right. Those signals are then sent to the binaural bus, which decodes the emisonic signals to binaural sign signals using the binaural decoder. To position your source, you can either use the controls in the right of the plugin, or the sphere panner in the left. Just click and drag the source to position it to the front, the left, the right, the back, or above you. You can switch to the lower hemisphere by just moving the mouse outside the sphere. So now the signals are coming from below. With this kind of projection, the resolution of elevation near the horizon is quite bad, as you can see here. You can change the projection to a linear elevation projection by double-clicking the sphere. Now you have a finer control. Every circle depicts 15 degrees of elevation. With another double-click you can switch back to the default projection. If you want to only change the azimuth, you can simply right-click the button and move the source. To split the audio into left and right, we have to increase the stereo width, which you can do here. So listen to the audio and watch the energy visualizer while I move the source around. That's it for now. Let's add the FDN reverb and listen to it again. <laughs> 